Chapter 2. Know Thyself Friends, we're going to take up here what has been shown and proved in over 60 years of research work. We have the scientific proof today that every function, everything in this whole universe is divine. Name that divinity what you will. The greatest name is the word God. Why? We can show you today that that word vibrates at the rate of 186 billion beats per second. And we know people capable of intoning that word. But the beauty of it is, the moment that you realize that vibration, you are that vibration every time. Now it is, now it is established in every form. It isn't just your form or the form of anybody else. It is established in everything and were it, were it not for that divinity, we are proving today that we couldn't take a photograph. There wouldn't be a form in this room that we could photograph today if it were not for that divinity. Now we have absolute proof of that. Then... Why say that I am not divine? Just leave the not out of that and see what difference it will make. I am divine. And there's the truth about yourself. The untruth is, I am not divine. The truth is, I am divine. Complete that saying and carry right through. God, I am. We make those statements for the very reason that we know today. We have been told that, yes, you have been told that, yes, but what someone else tells you, you may take with a grain of salt. Or you may say, well, perhaps that person doesn't know. But today we know through experiment in photography and high magnification and we can take any person and ask him to sit before this camera under high magnification and it will show that divinity every time. Our bodies started from the one cell and the multiplication of that cell built this body. And we can show through high magnification today that that light never ceases. It is transmitted from one cell to the other as the body is built up. It doesn't matter what you think about it or what you say about it. It is established in that vibratory frequency and it never goes out of that frequency. There is proof of these things today. The eye. One of the greatest things in our body today it's all, is also adjusted. The rods and cones and the retina are so adjusted that they take in that divinity the moment that we realize that divinity, our eye becomes adjusted to it. And the frequency that it moves forth at. And it can be shown that those who have not in any way impaired their sight, that they themselves see that almost immediately by the acceptance that they are divine. Now, divinity is God in everything, in every form. Christ means the power to realize that divinity within. And don't we see the Christ in every face, in every form? That was one of the very first statements that Jesus made. We found that in our research work. Quote, I see the Christ in every face, in every form. When the first child was born, the Christ was born. End quote. 